Hello, Generic Tech Guy back with you again. Today you'll learn how to save a few bucks when you have to change your battery in your multi-battery APC Smart UPS battery backup power supply. I'm working today on the Smart UPS 1400. So what are the signs you need to replace your batteries? Well, that nagging red light on the front next to the battery indicator is one sign. Uh, another was when all of our equipment hooked up to this unit uh, shut off when the unit runs the auto test once a week. That's definitely a sign uh, that we noticed. You could go with genuine APC replacement battery packs. They are put together in a four-pack uh, for easy slide-out removal and replacement, but they cost about $130 for a pack of four. That sounds a bit pricey to me. Right here we have an 8-pack of generic batteries that only cost us $120 for the whole case of 8. That's like half off or something. One of the things that uh, suck about individual batteries is APC made the battery backup access area very tight fit, so it's uh, hard to get the batteries in or out of the unit for replacement. And adding tape to the batteries to pack them together for easy slide-in replacement can actually make them too big to fit the battery access area. So what to do? Well. It involves duct tape, of course. You have to put it just where it's really needed, along the bottom of the battery. I used two strips of duct tape along the bottom of the batteries. I made the tape a little long, so you can fold it over and have a grip. You can then pull on to pull the battery pack out the next time you need to replace them. The extra duct tape I used on the sides here was removed before I went to put the pack into the UPS battery tray as it uh, can hang on the sides and can keep the pack from sliding into the tray smoothly. Another note here, um, there are eight terminals, four negative and four positive, that have to be hooked up properly to the eight normally unlabeled wires that hook up uh, the UPS. Well, before you remove the old batteries, be sure and use a permanent magic marker to label the terminals one through eight so you can match them back up and uh, not blow up the unit or the batteries. Then all you have to do is hook up the terminals in order. Notice my amazing counting skills as I use my finger to point as I count. And this thing is kind of a pain as you have to hook up the back part and partially slide it in. And then uh, you hook up the front wires and then uh, you, you push it a little further and you're finished. There you go. After that, just close the panel and put the screws back in. Hmm, seems I uh, forgot my screwdriver. Well, no problem. My Swiss Army knife comes to the rescue again. And that's all there is to it. Save yourself about half off on your replacement costs for APC replacement battery packs. This has been Generic Tech Guy. Thanks for watching. Hope you have a great day. See you next time. Tech Guy out.